children, I'm Alex. Let's start our Letters and Sounds lesson and learn to read some new words. Let's begin by reading some phonemes that you already know. I'll show you the graphemes on the cards and I want you to read them aloud. The first card says F. Are you ready to begin? Off you go. Let's check you got them right. Read aloud with me. O, 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 Oi, mixing time. Let's read the graphemes on the card. I want you to read them aloud. Off you go. Right. Let's check. Read aloud with me. Ooh. 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 Ow. Ow. Or. Uh. Uh. O. O. Oi. Oi, o, o, well done, super sounds. Let's read some words with graphemes we already know. Can you spot the digraph? Yes, the digraph is oi. Read each sound as I point. Now blend and read the word. J, oi, joy. I am full of joy when the sun shines. Have a look at the next word. Can you spot the digraph? That's right, oi. Read each sound as I point. Now blend and read the word. A, n, oi, annoy. If we annoy people, they won't want to play with us. Have a look at the next word. Can you spot the digraph? That's right, the digraph is ow. Read each sound as I point. Now blend and read the word. F, ow, n, d, found. They found some long lost toys under their bed. Can you spot the digraph? Yes, the digraph is ow. Read each sound as I point. Now blend and read the word. P, r, oud, proud. I hope you are proud of your epic reading. Can you spot the digraph? Yes, the digraph is er. Uh. 
Read each sound as I point. Now blend and read the word. Skirt, skirt. Final word. Can you spot the digraph? That's right, the digraph is or. Read each sound as I point. Now blend and read the word. Kl or claw. An animal's claws can be sharp. Watch out. Great reading. Now I'm going to mix them up. Can you read the words on the card without any help? I want you to read them aloud. Final word. Let's check. Read them with me. Skirt. Annoy. Claw. Found. Joy. Proud. Today we are learning to read a new way of writing the sound f. Can you say it? Let me hear you. And again. Well done. Let's sound talk some words with the phoneme f. Copy me. Say the sounds and then see if you can blend the sounds to say the word. F-o-n. 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 Phone. Shall I call you on my mobile phone? Copy me. Say the sounds then blend the sounds to say the word. Dolphin. A dolphin is an amazing sea mammal and it looks like this. Let's sound talk our final word. Copy me. Say the sounds then blend the sounds to say the word. Sphinx. The Sphinx is an enormous statue from ancient Egypt. It looks like this. We know the sound of f is written like this. But there is another way to write the sound f. It looks like this. Let's read the new grapheme for the sound f. Can you say the f sound each time I show you the grapheme f? Are you ready? One more time. That was excellent. Now let's read some words with our new grapheme for the sound f. Are you ready? This is our first word. Sound talk each grapheme and then blend to read the word aloud. Now let's read the word together. F-o-n. Phone. Did you get it right? Well done. Sound talk each grapheme and then blend to read the word aloud. Did you get it right? Well done. Now let's read the word together. S-f-i-n-x. Sphinx. Do you remember what the Sphinx is? That's right, it's this. S 
sound talk each grapheme and then blend to read the word aloud. Now let's read the word together. D -o -l -f -i -n. Dolphin. Did you get it right? Did you remember what a dolphin looks like? Here it is. Next word. Sound talk each grapheme and then blend to read the word aloud. Did you get it? E -l -e -f -a -n -t. Elephant. Elephants live in the continents of Africa and Asia and they have long trunks. Sound talk each grapheme and then blend to read the words aloud. Now let's read the word together. A -f -a -b -e -t. Alphabet. The letters A to Z in order is called the alphabet. Final word. Sound talk each grapheme and then blend to read the word aloud. Let's read the word together. P -r -o -f -e -t. Profit. A prophet is a person who tells people about things that will happen in the future. Some people believe a prophet is a person who speaks for God. Can you read these words without any help? Off you go. Let's check. Read them with me. Phone. Sphinx. Dolphin. Elephant. Alphabet. Prophet. Now I'm going to mix the words up. Are you ready? Can you read the words on the card without any help. I want you to read them aloud. Off you go. Let's check. Read them with me. Sphinx. Dolphin. Elephant. Alphabet. Profit. Phone. Incredible. We are on fire today, children. Now let's learn to read a tricky word. We are going to learn to read the word many. Well, the first bit is easy. Mmm. But the second bit is tricky. This bit says eh. Then it's n, mm, And the last bit is tricky too. This says e. When I read it, I say m, e, n, e, many. Now read the word with me. M, e, n, e, many. Awesome. Read it yourself. What's the word? Sorry, what was that? Yes, well done. The word is many. M, e, n, e, many. Now let's practice reading these tricky words that you have met before. Can you remember the two tricky bits in this word? This bit, ooh, and this bit here says air. Double tricky, but we can do it. Can you read the word? Did you read it? Let's read it together. Ooh, air, w. 
square. Now let's practice reading this tricky word that you have met before. Have a look at this word. Can you remember the tricky bit? Can you remember? That's right. The tricky bit is at the beginning. This bit says, ooh. Can you read the word? Did you read it? Well done. Let's read it together. Ooh, eh, n, when. Now let's read some sentences with our new Grapheme in it. Can you see the words with today's Grapheme? Well done. Here and here. Can you see any other digraphs? Well done. There's two in this word. K and k. Here's e. And here's our split vowel digraph o. Can you see the tricky word my? Have a look. Well done. Here it is. Now I want you to read aloud as I point to the words. Excellent reading. Now let's read the sentence together. Quick, get my phone. I can see a dolphin. Imagine seeing a dolphin. I would take a picture with my phone too. Wow! Let's finish by spelling some words because if you can read a word then you can have a go at spelling it. You will need your paper and something to write with. Let's spell two words with today's grapheme f. Let's spell phone. Segment the sounds with me. Phone. O N. Let's count how many sounds there are. Phone. F O N. That's three sounds. Watch me write phone. Remember, I need three sounds. Start with our digraph. Now we need our O. Can you remember how to do your O sound? Remember, it's your split vowel digraph, O. O. And our final sound is N. O. N. Phone. But remember, children, when we're writing, we would write it like this. P H O N E phone. I'm going to hide it. Have a go. Remember your f digraph and your split vowel digraph o. Write it down. Let's check our spelling. F o n phone. Did you get it right? Well done. Now let's spell dolphin. Segment the sounds with me. Dolphin. D -o -o -f -i -n. Let's count how many sounds there are. Dolphin. D -o -o -f -i -n. That's six sounds. Watch me write dolphin. Remember, I need six sounds in this word. Oh. Ooh. 
Dolphin. Now your your turn. Have a go. Remember your digraph. Did you get it right? Well done. O, U, F, E, N, dolphin. Now let's learn to spell a tricky word. We can read the word many, so now let's spell it. Segment the sounds with me. Many, M, E, N, E. Let's count how many sounds there are. Many, M, E, N, E. That's four sounds. Watch me write many. Remember, I need four sounds. The first bit is easy. Mm. And the A says eh in this word. Then it's N. Mm. And the Y says E. M, E, N, E. Many. Now you have a go. What's the tricky bit? The letter A says E. And the letter Y says E. Write it down. Let's check our spelling. M, E, N, E. Many. Did you get it right? Well done. Now let's practice this tricky word that you have met before. When. Segment the sounds with me. When. W, E, N. Let's count how many sounds there are. W, E, N. That's three sounds. Watch me write when. Remember, we need three sounds. Can you remember the tricky bit? That's right. The sound W is made with the letters W, H. And the rest of it is easy. When. Eh. U, eh. N. When. Now you have a go. Remember, O is written W H. Write it down. Let's check our spelling. O E N when. Well done, children. You have worked so hard practicing reading and spelling. See you next time for another lesson with letters and sounds. Bye.